Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing my finale for the May Mass Challenge. Um, let's just get into what I finished up. I have two of this KNC Beauty All Natural Retinol Infused Eye Masks. They were okay. Um, I wouldn't repurchase these again. I prefer the Grace and Stella Eye Masks better or even the... Um, Skin Iceland ones, so no one knows. I have this Othermal Avene Soothing Sheet Mask. Um, this was fine. It, I don't think it was worth the ten dollars that this was. I did not pay ten dollars for it. This was actually sent to me in a swap, so. Yeah, it wasn't that great. Um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't seek this out. Then I have this Bolero Rejuvenating Paper Mask. This was really nice for one dollar from the Dollar Tree. I'll have to look at my Dollar Tree to see if we have any more. This was actually sent to me from a friend, so this was really nice. I really did like this. It made my face really super soft, so yes, I liked that one. I have this It's Skin Rose uh, Sheet Mask. Um, <clears throat> I didn't really like this one. Um, it made my face kind of itchy, so whatever was in this mask kind of irritated my skin. It didn't make it red, it just itched a little. So um, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't buy this again because of, the, because of that. Then I have this uh, Skin Food Snail Mask. This was really nice. Um, it was. I don't know if I'd buy it again, but it was nice to try. So. This is a double pack of the oatmeal oxygen bubble mask. These are okay. I got this off of Shop Miss A. So. I mean, it was a dollar. It was nice to try, but I wouldn't buy it again. It wasn't that mind blowing. And I have this um, Tony Moly Cactus Mask Sheet. This was alright. It wasn't my favorite of the Tony Moly sheets. I don't think I'd buy this one again. Um, this one though, I liked this green tea one. It really smelled really nice and it made, it, um, made my skin feel really nice and moisturized. So I would probably get this one again. And these... I have two Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Masks. These were awesome. Perfection. Definitely repurchase these. You know me. I like anything Tatcha. So. Um, this is the last one of these tiny masks that I got. I didn't like any of these that I've tried, so I wouldn't buy these again. And I got this uh, Masquerade Pre-Party Prep. Eh. It was nothing special, so it was nice to try, but I wouldn't buy it again. Oh, let go. Now it's sticky. Anyway, um, this is the Found Coconut Sheet Mask. You can get these at Walmart. They are all right. Um, I don't think I'd get this one again. This is the Esfolio Mermaid Mask. You can get these at Big Lots for $1.20. I really, they were kind of fun to use, but I don't think I'd buy them again. They were just kind of fun, you know? Pretty fun. And anyway, um, I'll pull those apart in a minute. This is the e.l.f. Uh, moisturizing Mask. Now, I think I tried the brightening one, the lemon one. I didn't like this one, but this one was nice. I'd get this, I'd pick this one up again. It's like two dollars on the website. Next is this Timeless Beauty Glam and Glow Sheet Mask. These are really nice. I got these in Ipsy and I looked on the website to see how much they were because I did total up how much I used for the for the month of May for the masks. And the this is six dollars for this one, but I think it's worth it because it's really, really nice. I, you know, it's like it says, it's radiant boosting, it's fresh, 
and cool. So I really do like this one. I think I have another one. I think it's stuck to everything else. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. These Sephora masks I got in a pack for um, Christmas. And they all stuck together with all this glue. You can see all the glue on it. But anyway. Um, these two Sephora masks. Um, I didn't like the pomegranate one. That was... It was okay. Not my favorite, but this pearl one, I did like. So I would buy this pearl one again, just not the pomegranate one. But if it came in a pack, I would use the pomegranate one again. But but yeah, I wouldn't purchase it singly. And my last one is this Timeless Beauty Bar Up in the Clouds. This is the other one I got in my Ipsy. This one's really nice too. So I would purchase this again. And my total for just these masks, there are 20 of them, is $92. So that's quite a bit there. I think it's it's in it's due to the Tatcha mask. They're like $12 a piece. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed my main mask challenge. Um, let me know if you did the challenge also. Let me know how you did. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.